Japanese Princess Kiko has given birth to a baby boy. He is the first imperial male heir to be born in four decades. The meaning, woman will be kept off the throne. According to Japanese tradition, a male born into the royal family can be considered a possible heir to the throne. It isn't too much surprise the Japanese government would welcome news of the newly born baby boy. The birth of the new prince is an extremely happy occasion. I am relieved and happy to have heard that both princess and new prince are in good health. Prime Minister Junichiro Koizumi has revised the law to give women equal rights to ascend the throne, but Kiko's pregnancy put the proposal on hold. Experts agree reform of the succession law will be needed, ensuring male heirs is difficult without a royal concubine. The crown prince, Naruhito, after all, has a daughter. Um, I guess the other issue to comment on is, is um, how you often see the claim in, in papers um, and you know, certainly by conservatives in Japan that we have something like a, a 2,000 year old tradition um, of only, female, oh, sorry, only male emperors when in fact that's, that's quite untrue. Employees and reporters of the conservative newspaper Sankei Shimbun were mobilized to help print and distribute extra editions celebrating the son of Prince Akishino and Princess Kiko. It is great news because the boy is the first male heir in the imperial family in 41 years. We think it is worthwhile to issue the extra. Many on the streets are happy to hear the baby was a boy. In a word, I am relieved. I think the debate over imperial succession will not settle down by this as the boy is not over crown prince.